I deployed uh, twice to Afghanistan and once to Kosovo. In Afghanistan, I was a platoon leader and an executive officer. In Kosovo, I was an operations officer. My best memory from the military has got to be serving with the men and women that I've served with, having the opportunity to be their leader, to be their leader during combat operations. The great responsibility was humbling and it was an honor, and that's probably the best memory and the best experience that I've had throughout my service in the military. After my second deployment, I was injured in a vehicle accident, and then when I came back, I was trying to figure out what I wanted to do. I talked to a couple of people and decided to go back to graduate school. So here at WVU, I am pursuing a PhD in English literature. Probably the most difficult part about the transition between military and academic life is just the mindset, just the mentality. Sometimes over the course of a weekend, from a Sunday to a Monday, you need to switch gears from one mentality to the other. Just from speaking to some of the library staff, the Dean's Office of Strategic Initiatives is coming up with some very exciting programs trying to expand the services for student veterans, not just within the library system, but throughout the whole university. WVU seems to have made it a priority to help try to foster this community of veterans. The library is the focal point of knowledge, of information, of resources. You couldn't separate the library from student academic success because that's where all of the resources are at. And your professors guide the way, they help you to think in new and interesting ways, but the library is where that information is held, it's where it's kept.